Uh, when I come out of the station, uh, I was going to a VSA call, and when I pulled out on the, onto the apron, I saw what's behind us burning, fully involved garage fire. Uh, kind of had to take a double take because I wasn't expecting that. And I pulled into the into the house and ran up. Like I say, the, the flames were rolling out of the eaves. Um, I didn't see anybody around. I knew there was people there because I worked yesterday. I, I knew they were home. All the cars were in the yard. So I, I ran up, banged on the door, but the flames were coming out of the eaves so bad I couldn't stay there. I had to come back, get my gear on, and uh, back to the house, bang on the door some more. Ran around the back. To, I was going to try and get in from the back because I knew there was patio doors back there. And they were coming out as I was yelling to go to the back. So I knew they were I knew they were out then, but after talking to the homeowner, like it was it was me beating on their door that got them up. The smoke detectors weren't going off yet. So uh, I'm very fortunate, you know, for for them that all that happened when it did. There was somebody that pulled over on the side of the road, and uh, I'm sure they were calling 911 as I was rolling up. But I mean, we were we we're right there, you know, a minute away. So it was just too far gone though when we got here. And how does that make you feel, the fact well, it that... it makes me feel good, for sure. It, it makes me feel really good. Um, I mean, that's our job, right? That's what we're supposed to do, protect lives. And, you know, it's nice when everything works out in your favor, so...